This is Kertas model SPM4, paper 1, number 5. Okay, the diagram 5 shows the graph of quadratic function of, so we have this, fx equals to x plus 6 and x plus 1. So this is the graph given. Now, we need to find the value of k. This is the k. Now, how can we do this? We can always find the x-intercept. Okay, we can always find the x-intercept. So how? So isn't it the x-intercept is at x-axis? So at x-axis, we know that the fx equals to 0, right? At x-axis, y equals to 0. So this whole thing, x plus 6, x plus 1 equals to 0. Therefore, x can be negative 6 or negative 1. So this is negative 6 and this is negative 1. Isn't it this part will be the uh, minimum point? And since we know that quadratic graph is actually symmetrical, symmetrical, so that means it will divide this into two equal parts. So let's find the midpoint. So we want to find the x here. Therefore, the midpoint of x coordinates that will be negative 6 plus negative 1. So it became negative 1 over 2. So we will have negative 3 point five okay so with that if x coordinate equals to negative three point five so we want to find the k the y value therefore substitute substitute the value of x negative three point five into the function then we will have negative three point five plus six and then negative 3.5 plus 1. So with this, we use the calculator. Negative 3.5 plus 6 times with negative 3.5 plus 1. So we will have negative 6.25 as our answer because when x is negative 3.5 the image is k so that is our answer for question number five now when we uh, give this as the answer we will get one point i mean the final answer is this three marks or uh three marks the second marks will be given over over here okay and the third marks will be from the midpoint now of course you have another solution that is using the completing the square that one also can okay